Let's have a good time this weekend. It's gonna be awesome. We are heading to um, Cape Coast, but we can't do the trip with an empty cup. So Roy is setting me up nicely. <laughs> I need something sweet. On your feet. Guys, so we are currently, this is like that pump stretch, right? I'm sorry, my glasses are foggy from the AC in the car, but you're saying this is a beehive. Where are the bees? Where's the hive? I don't know why we have like lots of really cool um, places and it belongs to the government, but then they never like talk about it enough for people to even know of its existence. Like if not for Roy, I wouldn't know that this place existed. And it's like pretty, pretty cool. Quiet and very, very serene. Look at this, you guys. And it's just sitting here. I never knew we had an actual beehive structure in this country. But we do. Imagine. I'm trying to see if I can get close enough. I'm trying to see. Okay, I see something. There's, a, there's an inscription on a tree that says nursery lane. Oh my god, bees. I'd go closer, but I don't want to get stung. Like, I really don't want to die. <laughs> but look at them. This is one particular structure. They have like several of them in there. They're just sitting in there. And I think this is like really, really cool. So apparently it's like a mini reserve to like produce, how do you call it, honey? The bees do their thing and then they get the honey. I don't know what they do with it, sell it, whatever. You can stop by and then just chill and relax it's mostly unsupervised so yeah next on the itinerary i'm sure we'll be making a lot of stops on the way because this is like a proper proper tour thing uh but the final destination is buriwa beach resort roy won't shut up about it he's talked about it for days apparently it's a really cool spot and i have to check it out so that's like the final destination so guys buckle up it's about to be a very fun trip Fill your cup. You need that energy. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Ouch. Hi guys, it's your favorite human butterfly. Mm, um, if exhaustion had a face, it would look like mine. If I tell you that I am exhausted, it wouldn't come close to what I'm feeling right now. I am tired. It is currently, what time is it? Hold on. Um, oh shit, I'm recording. I can't. Oh, okay, I got it. It's currently 4.11 and um i just got to buriwa beach resort it's on the cape coast stretch basically um i was supposed to get here way earlier way earlier like around two o'clock but being the butterfly that i am i am never ever able to go to one specific location finish with it and then move on to the next i always have to be doing random things at one given time and because of that i never have time to finish up anything because i was supposed to like it was supposed to be a straightforward journey like drive leave a car get here chill but i had to stop at fort amsterdam get videos i had to go to abanze mingle with the locals like it was fun though so i guess i can't really complain but basically this is where i'm gonna be for today 
this place is magical you guys it's so so beautiful one thing that is blowing my mind the peace like it's super 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 quiet it's calming i am simping for this like i wish i could live here for the rest of my life because it's so like super super calm and you know how i have ties to nature yeah so i'm absolutely loving the nature touch that it has here it has a beautiful view like the view is mad this is the type of place that you come to and then like you forget all your worries everything just disappears from your head a car can go fuck itself honestly don't tell anybody i said that <laughs> but <laughs> I've been hearing about this. I don't have a lot of time to do a lot of things, but they don't have like any actual activities or whatever, but they have a gigantic pool. So if you love to swim, that one is definitely for you. And there's easy access to like the beach area. You can go get into the water, swim, like do whatever you want. And you can just like chill. They have foods, they have everything. So I'm gonna be taking you guys on like a tour of the environment. Then after that, maybe i don't know i'll figure <laughs> i'll figure out what i want to do from there but let's just check out how beautiful this place actually is and the plants jesus christ i'm gonna have to talk to somebody and ask them how many plants i can pick and take home because because it's just like so type beautiful you guys so this is my apartment this is where i'm living and this is like the stretch of apartments like that they have the rooms that they have it goes all the way to the end over there they have like these um hangout spaces in front of each room so when you get tired you just want to enjoy the view you can just sit here and chill and as you can see the place is flooded in greens there are plants everywhere Guys, I met Julian and Prince. I didn't get your name, Prince. Yeah. How are you guys? Yeah, After a stressful week, we uh, just wanted to take some time off and then you know, release some stress. Yeah. And Julian says he knows me, but he doesn't follow me. <laughs> you people. <laughs> Why don't you follow yeah, me I'm though? Sure you don't follow people who don't follow back. <laughs> 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 no, that's true. I'm gonna follow you so that you can follow me back. Okay. Does that make I'm sense? Charge you my phone, so that's follow fine. That's perfect. Oh, follow back. Oh, follow back. Okay. <laughs> it was very nice to meet you. Please follow. I'll follow you back. Yeah. I promise. <laughs> Enjoy your time. Roy came in with souvenirs. Um, let me see. So either this or that. Yeah, no, I think I'm gonna. I love colors, so this works. <laughs> And when you come through, just ask for Claudia. Claudia is the owner of the place and say Roy sent you. She'll do you, she'll do you good. This is supposed to be like a chill trip. I'm supposed to come here and relax. But unfortunately, it just hits me that I can't do that because my phone is out of space, right? I'm out of storage. So it means I have to edit some videos and then be able to delete some of the footages because I have too much stuff on my phone. Like I have too much pictures, videos, it's just too much. I always have a hard time deleting stuff. Like even the stuff that I don't need, I know very well that I'm never ever going to use this particular footage, but I'll never delete it because I just like having stuff on my phone.
um it's a good morning it's a beautiful morning everything just looks beautiful and amazing and oh my god you guys i had the best sleep of my entire life i had the most amazing sleep i have ever had in my life like i slept like a baby full-on flight mode reset i left reality you guys like i slept and it was just crazy the only downside is i had too much last night because i got hungry like right in the middle of the night and i was like no i have to eat so i ordered rice they have like this special rice plain rice and then chicken stew lord it was good their food is very very good so if you're coming here that's one thing you should look out for and the prices are very cool too it's like in the range of 50 70 cities like it makes a lot of sense for a full course meal so i had that and it's kind of making me feel bloated but that's fine we'll sweat it out this morning so um i just stepped outside and i met the owner and we had like a full-on conversation quick history can you believe that this place is like the oldest resort on this stretch like it has been around for the longest time according to her the types of mills rawlings they used to come here in the past they used to like come jam here so it's quite surprising that a lot of people don't know about the existence of this place honestly like it's a really cool spot she says it's been around for 40 years 40 good years and if you see the condition that it's in amazing like they've kept up the maintenance and everything is just like spot on oh and one other thing she mentioned was that the beachfront is literally deserted there's nobody there it's only once in a while that you meet like one or two fishermen like doing their thing over there but then usually there is nobody there it's dead quiet guess what that is good for skinny dipping <laughs> I am going skinny dipping like I'm in my bikini ting tings and um, I'm just going to find like a very secluded spot stick up my clothes and hit the water so if you ever come here that's one thing that should be on your list going skinny dipping I have never skinny dipped in my life so this is like a big time achievement for me buns out hit the water and I'm about to have an amazing time I will find you guys once my butt is wet Mwah. Like once you like pay for a room, you have full access to the entire place. You have access to use every single thing here, including the pool. It's so cool. So so super cool. I'm just gonna chill in here for a while and then um we're gonna continue to another resort, but there's been an emergency in the car, so unfortunately we have to go back. So I'm just gonna be in here for like maybe 30 minutes or an hour because like the water feels too good for me to get out right now. So yeah, after that, I'm sure we'll check out and then we'll leave. All right guys, so I am heading back to Accra. Um, it's very unfortunate, but I can't stay here forever. So this has been an amazing trip. Make sure anytime that you get here, just say you're looking for Claudia. When you find Claudia, she's the owner of the place, just say, uh, Roy and Ajua um, referred you and you might get this guy. No, you might get this guy. You will get this guy. So just come through. It's a pretty place. Very serene. Very calm. Peaceful. Just come and relax. Forget all the noise in Accra. Just clear your mind. That kind of vibe. I will see you in the next video. I love you guys. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Make sure you're always sharing the content so other people can come watch it as well. Turn on your post notification if you can. Like the video. I I love you guys. I will see a peace out. Yeah, yeah, say. <laughs> Eh, man, 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 I'm a
about to get it in, I'll be right back. Uh, life is hard, let the bass trouble. Let the champagne pour, let them hate niggas. The Don't ever like let them tell you that you less than great the niggas. So I'll be so they always need about eight club, niggas. The stronger your team, the stronger your grind, better you push. You real homie seen whatever level you look. Real hustlers respected, they know whatever. Yeah, you know what you're trying to get uh twenty like city. Real yeah. success yeah. calls. And I buy you and it's just about fair saying. Baku and city. Let me see yeah. Guys, this is trophy. 20 yeah, cities, right. 20 cities trophy. Wish it on me. Thank you. I can't be buried. I don't want to be buried and I'm in start to media. Hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you. Yeah, buying five cities means. All right. Can't you buy your five cities? It is a five city one, another five cities. We got you. So far, so good. <laughs> Chubby is good. <laughs> Not bad. And I want to be a vegetarian in Africa. Chubby is what? Turkey? Yes, turkey. Yeah. Turkey tail. Turkey tail, yeah. That's right. Interesting. Yeah, I thought by any Chubby. Cheese thing, Ghana. Some mama too surprised, Maggie. Some other day. Too. 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 Too.